What is up guys, welcome back to another video, welcome back to another day and welcome back to Urban Backstreet Garage time lapses because all I'm doing tonight is sanding, sanding, sanding and more sanding. So I'm gonna get all the rest of my panels as they are here on the other side of the camera. We have the front lip, the arches and the boot lid. So tonight we're gonna wet sand the whole lot and get them ready for lacquer and then set them out, cover up the car and then leave. So I can get Aaron to do them hopefully during the week because I don't want to lacquer again because I'll just fuck it up and I don't really wanna do that. So yeah, let's get cracking. So guys, I just threw the arch on with the front lip on as well to test out these black trims and they fit absolutely perfect. The arch fits up against the lip perfect, but I do need to trim it on the inside here. As you see, it's stepping out a bit, so it's gonna catch the wheel. So I'm just gonna trim that straight down. So yeah, the front lip fits nice. I'm gonna put this black stuff on the front lip as well around the front. Yeah, everything's starting to fit nice and coming together and looking nice. Front of the car looks unreal i'm really happy with the finish i might actually leave the front lip like that because inside the engine bay and here is rimply as well but you can't really notice it that much it looks really good i'm really happy it looks cool from back here yeah it looks cool really like it Yeah, even from the front on this angle where the lip is and the tire looks really really good i'm liking the look of it. it looks them arches fit perfect to the car now i will lower it a bit but i need to get all the suspension geometry set up first but yeah she's starting to look cool yeah i'm happy with what i got done here guys i'm only down here for a few hours i'm in work tomorrow and i can't spend stupid time down here so the arches are prepped the front lip is on the boot lid is prepped but i might have to do a bit more paint to the boot lid because right on the edge there straight the primer so i might just have to blow in up here or even just touch it with a pen i don't know what way it works i'll ask aaron so once again we're on track with lacquer and everything and getting the car together the second i have all the body panels on and the brakes sorted i need to bleed the brakes again then take the car on a quick test drive up and down the lane to make sure that the brakes are working then i can book it in get the alignment done and finally go on a drive finally yeah guys Appreciate you for watching. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, let me know what you think of the front lip. I absolutely love the front lip on this car. I can't wait to get the boot lid on with the spoiler. I'm also looking for a rear spoiler. There's a company in America. I can't actually think of the name of them. There's another company called Cactus Carbon stuff, but I am looking for the big spoiler. It's like a new-ish mini style spoiler. Goes on the back of the car up here, but it sticks out really. It's a really race look, so I'm really looking to get one of them. I think they're like 500 euro shipped to Ireland, but yeah, I'll have to save a bit. It definitely is worth getting. And yeah, the car is starting to look complete with that front, that front lip and that arch on makes the car look unreal. Let's have another look at it before we head off. So yeah, guys, mini looks sweet. 
time for me to head off i really do appreciate you guys for watching the videos so please give it a like comment what you think of the front lip and subscribe if you're not subscribed it really means a lot to me guys so i really appreciate you for watching and i shall see you in the next one and don't forget be dedicated guys be dedicated peace out